Welcome to Good Mythical More. Uh, we pride ourselves here at Mythical Entertainment with hiring the best, most toxic people we can find. That's right. <laughs> so today we're going to bring on the uh, the most toxic. No, of the toxic. they're not the most toxic. I didn't listen. I didn't come up with the term. They toxic. just have things that are toxic about them. They have a toxic. It, we're using the term loosely. It's related to these. I'm things. not. <laughs> um, we're going to find out what toxic trait these crew members but have. But first. Let's play Who You Talking About. We're going to read a comment that one of you left. Who it's about? either about me or about him. This one comes from uh, Kalulita, who says, Blank's aorta was about to explode trying to whisper men. Men? <laughs> Blank's aorta whisper was about men. to explode trying to whisper men. I don't, I mean, this is obviously the whisper challenge. Who really got into so it? So much of your... It'd be like, men. Neck is covered up by man, hair. Man, man. It's not. We're not it's, the, it's the heart. We're not talking about the oh. goozle. Oh, we're I not thought, talking about. The, I thought we were talking about the, the um, artery. Aorta is like a part of the heart, right? It's like a chamber of the heart. Well, that's not even visible. Um, so it's like whose heart was about to explode? Saying, man, yours. Okay, I'll say me. I don't know. Oh, it was you. My aorta was about to explode. Yep. I'm trying to whisper me in. Mm -hmm. All right. And you don't even remember it. Let's see it. <laughs> ba. Not ba. Mm. Ma. Ma. No, no, just mm. 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 Mommy. <laughs> mm. 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 No. Madonna. <laughs> <laughs> It's funny to watch that back while being able to hear and think, you thought that would be helpful. <laughs> Come it's on like, in, guys. That's why it's so hard to play that game. I'm going to move back here to the corner, give you guys plenty Welcome. of room to cram Kaylin, in. Kaylin, Carney, Hello. Michaela, and Megan hey. to the show Don't after be shy. the show. Okay. Right here. Right on over here. Oh. Wow. You guys, Invisible. you know what? You don't okay. seem hey. toxic. Just when, nice you, when you come okay, here, and give me just a little, and you bit. sit down. Yeah. I would say, oh, this is a pleasant, pleasant bunch. Yeah, well, look oh. at this pleasant bunch. How on earth are we going to determine the toxicity of their, well, of their beings? I have a toxicity meter. Uh, it is a because apparently you can measure that via electromagnetic field. So I'm just going to do just uh, just a little bit, just on each person's <laughs> forehead. <laughs> Point seven. <laughs> Point eight oh, needs more toxic. Yeah. <laughs> yep, yeah. <laughs> Point eight. Oh, oh, is it really moving? Okay, you guys are more toxic than that. <laughs> what about, what, about, what about me? I have a metal plate in my head. <laughs> it <just> explodes. Uh, <laughs> oh, Link. Point six. You're the least toxic. Oh, oh, maybe that's wow. like golf scores. What's though? me? What's <laughs> me? Right. That is yeah. right. Yeah. One? Yeah, yeah. Like so one like point zero? One. No, it's like point, point one. Point one? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I have almost no toxicity. Yeah, I think it's. I guess it's because I, I I'm doing it to myself, yeah, yeah. probably. Yeah, it's going up. So I'm the least toxic. The more you're the you think you're not toxic, toxic, you guys are the most toxic. Okay. We'll take that into account. <laughs> yeah. But we're going to actually, you've all admitted, this is self disclosure. So you admit mm -hmm. these things about you. Last time I was on here, by the way, I was the only guy also. Mm -hmm. And I said something about having an orgasm at a funeral, and everybody got uncomfortable. <laughs> and I'm not going to do that again. Okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 You're not going to talk about that orgasm in a funeral. No. Yeah. Yeah. yeah everybody, yeah. the comments are like, "Oh, that's not cool, man." Yeah. Yeah. We're not even going to think about orgasm it. at a funeral. Weird. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. Yeah. Right. Yeah. You're not going to think about it. Nope. Or talk about it. Most of those right. comments were me. <laughs> Over the past six months, I have gotten dinner through Postmates every single night. Maybe, except maybe three to four times. I have a rotation of six places I order from, and I probably account for a majority of their profits at this point. I believe that last sentence is in jest. Uh, an six, exaggeration. Over the past six months. But apparently, yeah, every single night except three or four times. Mm. And wow. this person thinks this is a toxic trait, maybe because it's just like this isn't a, the wisest use of your resources, or you don't, you don't like Uber who owns Postmates. I don't know. There's multiple mm. ways that this could be interpreted. You know, <laughs> uh, I, I'm trying to figure out who doesn't like to cook for themselves. You know, um, does this strike you guys as like an odd thing? I wonder. 
Seems like excessive. No, it, it strikes me as something that I would feel bad about, but then I would be like ta talking to my therapist about it, and then I would realize, <laughs> you know what? I'm not a bad person, or at least as bad as I thought I was. This is what my therapy's like. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, the frequency of people Maybe doing doing this doing Postmates or whatever takeout is gone way, way up. Oh, yeah, I mean, so, it, it, supporting the economy. We definitely, there's not a week that goes bad. by in our house. It feels house. Like, <laughs> luxurious to me. Like, it feels like, wow, what a... That what is a, nice. It's very nice. Point, yeah. This Day person retweet. definitely has, like, the... Retweet. The free delivery, uh, you know... Oh, unlimited. Oh, you got, you got to have the unlimited. You know yeah. who's got a newborn in the house? Uh, probably Carney. You know who has... <laughs> <laughs> Michaela, uh, you have something to tell us? No. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, you don't you don't have time for much anything except survival because of the baby, because of that baby. Well, after that funeral, you know, six months later, and the Matt, nine good. months later, Matt, don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> so th that could work. Funeral, but you can't get you can't give babies things off Postmates. Are you a cooker? Yeah. I'm a cleaner. You're a cooker. Are you I'm a, a cooker? cooker. Mm -mm. Okay. I was kind of leaning Megan. Let's give it to Megan right now. I mean, she she owned up to it. She's not a cooker, but it could go to Carney. You're wrong. I'm always correct. Even when I'm not, I still am. Ooh. Uh, you're wrong about that. <laughs> Do you want to hold it? Does it feel good? Does it feel good for you to hold it? Listen, <laughs> you know, it's it, this is it's just not it's not a matter of perspective. It's a matter of just track record. I mean, I, some some people just can't help but be right most of the time. Right, that's true. <laughs> I lured you into that one, girl. You did. I lured you into that one. Well, you don't know. Yeah, that's you true. Know. I just could be agreeing with you. Yeah, that's right. You could be. You could have mm. multiple just toxic traits. Yeah. yeah. You that's could have true. multiple toxic traits. Let me see if you've got any. More did it go down? I feel like he's gonna go down. Oh, he did. 0. 0.7. That oh. Maybe she's telling the truth. You're wrong. People are gonna be like, "Where do I get one of those?" <laughs> <laughs> okay. I think significantly less of you if you don't have a positive view of the media that I like. Polarization, maybe. <laughs> if you don't like the media, the that media I like. that I like. Mm. Okay. But but this was okay. Now, what does that mean? When you when when you say media bias. We're talking about like your news sources, or are we talking about like the shows that you like? <laughs> you know, like if you don't like Teen Wolf, if you're not excited about the new <laughs> season Wolf. of Westworld that Wolf. everyone else can no Wolf. longer understand, Michael J. Fox on that too. You know, no, 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 no. Dylan no, O'Brien, yeah, yeah, Dylan O'Brien for <laughs> I sure. Teen Wolf for like a very the movie time. Teen Wolf with Michael no, J. Fox. No, no. <laughs> we weren't born. Then. You remember <laughs> we when we were alive? <laughs> you know, what did you do on this movie? I, well, it was, I, show. Not, it was the TV the show. The show yeah. um, was it when he was, was like standing on top of the van, body surfing. Um. That was probably. the movie. No, <laughs> um, Matt, we were not probably. alive. Yeah, we literally weren't. You should existence. check out that. Yeah, yeah that's good. good. It doesn't I'm hold up at all. Yeah. <laughs> I think media is well, all you encompassing, hair? right? All encompassing? Yeah, like, just an intern. You know, it can be music. Just an intern. Okay, so we're being told that this is probably a general thing. Because what I was going to say is, I want to go back to the good old days when media bias was just whether or not it was. Which local news crew from your city you prefer? <laughs> just I like Larry Gaddy's better than so and so at weather. W R A L. All the way. Person? Larry Gaddy. That's a real person. Well, he wasn't weather. What Charlie was Gaddy. Charlie Gaddy was the anchor. And then uh, who was the anchor on Channel Five? Bill uh, Leslie. That was Charlie Gaddy. Charlie Gaddy. Who was Bill that? Leslie in the morning? Who was Channel Eleven? Uh. Some loser. I didn't watch. Yeah, see? Aww. That was your media bias. <laughs> but this is someone who's enjoying certain things, and then they think less of you if you don't enjoy them. I think this could be... It could be anybody, because everybody mm -hmm. here is very opinionated about their media. Mm -hmm. Right, yeah. You gotta their be. standards are so high. You That's why be. they work here. Right, it's right. It's a prerequisite. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I, I think we got to move this one around, but you know what? I'm feeling Kaylin. I'm fine with that. Flaky. I reach out to people to make plans, but as soon as they ask to set a firm date, I get too overwhelmed and don't respond in a timely manner. Oh. Yeah, yeah, so you have these ideas but of you, like, at least you know that about I'm gonna have a party. It's like, let's get together, let's do this, let's do that. Yeah, I totally, I, I get it. And then it's like, but not right now, not this weekend. Yeah, not, not next weekend either. <laughs> yeah, that that isn't exact. I don't consider that flakiness though. Flakiness is like when somebody said they were going to do something and then they don't do it. 
But this is like uh, you get cold feet once somebody cold actually feet begins is what engaging. I would call it. Cold Social cold feet. Mm. Now you, Michaela, <laughs> you never turn down an opportunity for a good time. <laughs> You haven't seen me outside of work. But, I like my bed. But I hear, <laughs> <laughs> I hear you talk. I oh, hear you, you talk. You me. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. Talk. I was at this me. event. <laughs> <laughs> I was at this place. I just go to the tattoo parlor, and then I decide what tattoo I'm going to get. Yeah. That's what she said to me yeah, yesterday. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. I, yeah, oh, a growing really. amount. Mm -hmm. She just shows up. She yeah, you shows know, up and points she, at something. She's a free mm -hmm. spirit. <laughs> <laughs> that's right about everything. Mm -hmm. So you, that's not you. Um, mm, I mean, Carney's probably canceling a lot of things because you know, at this point, you got this new baby. Mm -hmm. You know, you 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 you're you're like you're you're, you're, you're friends who don't have kids. They don't have perspective anymore. You don't want to spend time with them because they don't understand life as deeply as you do. They don't. That's true. Right. See? They don't. They don't understand uh, I just switched everything. <laughs> <laughs> what, do you, what do you think about this? I feel like we should switch Postmates and Flaky. Postmates and Flaky. Because so Not because I feel strongly about I think that she, Kaylin being flaky. It's Megan was about so, Megan she reacted Postman. so I'm not a cooker. adamantly to not no. being a cooker mm -hmm. that I think she, she she knows how this game is played. Why would she do that? Oh, reverse, reverse? 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 Do you think she did that? I, like I think it's reverse, it. reverse, it's reverse. Game time. Deconstructing. Okay. Can I, right. can I produce for a second and I'll, <laughs> a, I'll offer a switcheroo? Uh, well, this is weird because you're in the game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 you, you know, I'm going to tell you, you have... Zero of four correct right now. Whoa, really? Okay, let's switch those back. Let's switch those back. No, this is gamifying, right? I guess. And okay, then let's switch media bias, that. and you're wrong. Let's switch the, these two. These two. Yep. Yep. Okay. Yep. This still adds up. Now we are 100. Before we give our answers, I just want to direct your attention to this cotton candy Randy T. It says hi, daddies, because that's what he says. Uh, you can get this. You can get a phone case with this on it. You can get a pop socket with this on it. Uh, you can get the new Mythical is Happiness tea as well. All available at Amazon.com slash Mythical. Check out our Amazon store. Slash Mythical. Don't go somewhere else on Amazon searching Mythical and buying bootleg stuff like that yeah. cornhole board. I think they made yeah. that with a stencil. Yeah, I think they made that. Yeah. Don't go making stuff with a stencil. <laughs> well, okay, you can't say that they can't Just buy stuff. If you're going to make it. From us. <laughs> All right. Sell it. No. <laughs> Megan. Are you flaky? Yeah, I'm flaky. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. But I like the cold feet. That feels a little bit you're, nicer. You're socially cold yeah. feet. Yeah. I just like looking at my calendar makes me want to throw up, but mm. I also can't live without it. So it's right. just mm. a toxic battle between me and my calendar at all times. Uh, Here's what I've noticed. <laughs> I, if I have a drink, at that point I'm like, oh boy, it would really be great to see this friend and to do this thing. Yeah, and drink. then you have a drink. You yeah. know, I'll text that person and be like, let's go do that thing and do and then in the morning when I'm sober or like closer to the event, I'm like, Oh God, you know, Buzz Stevie really <laughs> yeah. screwed the pooch on this yeah, one. Yeah, but if Stevie gets drunk again, she can have a good time. Yeah. With that person. And that's mm -hmm. what I mm -hmm. have to say to myself as I'm pushing through to follow right. through the plans you, you that I'm making. Get back in that headspace. Yeah. Just be the drunk floaty. all the time. Drunk Stevie. Yeah. 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 Basically, yeah. we're talking about day drunk. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like hanging out with drunk Stevie. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Day drunk is the best. She's pretty cool. That's yeah, she's cool. Okay, different topic. Mm -hmm. uh, are you always right? I am always right. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I've almost never been wrong. <laughs> See, I knew she I mean, like, She was right there. She's like, yep, that's right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We, we <laughs> nailed it. We'd like yeah, to have little it. stories with these, right? And so Michaela offered her story up on this. Mm -hmm. And it was like, it just said, I'm always correct. And I said, do you think you can maybe beef that up a little bit? You know, make it a little more entertaining? <laughs> and she said, nope, this is good. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I'm right about this, no. man. I'm yeah. right. Yeah. It so, was yeah. It was good. That's it. That's all you deserve. But I also agree. I feel the same way. About Michaela? About myself. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah. But you're okay. a Virgo. That's so we could have gotten that right. Yeah. yeah. If you guys ever get into an argument, who would win? I would. No. 
I'm sorry. <laughs> That's me. Okay. All right. I still win. Right. <laughs> right. We've been thinking about starting the <laughs> mythical in-house uh, boxing league. <laughs> if it's words, let's do it. <laughs> if it's words. Yeah, yeah. We've nailed this. Media bias. No, sir. You had, oh, you had me pegged from the very beginning. Quit, uh, quit pegging me, Link. You had me pegged <laughs> right off the bat. Matt, with the we just news. talked about oh. that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because of the baby. It. Blame yeah. it on the baby. It's, ex- it's exactly because of the baby. And I feel like it's just like you say, like, ooh, like, ooh, maybe it's like a luxury. Like, I don't know. All my money's going to meals these days. Like, yeah, well, and also that we could have taken advantage of the timing that you gave when you said the last however many months, mm-hmm. you know, it's Six, like, yeah. It's exactly right. What's yeah. what's on the rotation? Um, Thai food, Mendocino Farms, um, Tokaya Tacos. Oh, yeah. Are you counting them off? Um, mm-hmm. uh, Hugo's Spaghetti and Meatballs, um, which accounts for why none of my clothes fit anymore. And That's from the Hugo's restaurant? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's good. A lot of spaghetti and meatballs these days, and there's another. I don't remember what it is, but... There's like six different things that we go through every single night, yeah. Hot chicken? Hot chicken? chicken. You don't order any hot chicken? No. No. I'm always going to post make some hot chicken. Yeah, Yeah, that ruins Mm -hmm. the next day. So, so media bias, this is you. Yeah, but I meant it more so in like TV shows, movies, stuff like that. Because like if we're friends, right? Yep. I like analyze your taste, what you like, your mood, your general disposition, all that. So if I'm recommending something to you, it's taking all of that into account. And if you're like, oh, no, that's for kids. No, I don't want to watch that. (laughs) You can respectfully get out of my life. (laughs) (laughs) You can get out of my life. What if they watch it and don't like it? That's fine. Okay, I I get that. Yeah, because then it's like you actually gave it a chance, whatever. But if you're just like, no, I think that's for kids or no, that looks stupid. It's like... (laughs) Mm-hmm. But Kaylin, <laughs> Kaylin, you have like the broadest, like most international taste in media, I think, of anyone yeah. here. So you're mm-hmm. saying that if someone's like, I, no, I don't like this specific K pop band, you're like, I hate you. And I will never <laughs> Only befriend if she you. She knows you and recommends it, and then you. Pre-poo-poo. Yeah, because like mm-hmm. I wouldn't recommend it to you if it didn't fit your music taste. So if you don't even listen and you're like, no, I don't like those boys. Uh, oh, yeah, right. yeah. Again, so can you make match. can you make a a general recommendation? Yeah, based on what you know about the mythical like, beasts. Mythical yeah, beasts? yeah, just like an unexpected thing that you're guaranteed to enjoy. You know we do they, this on our podcast. They, they hate grape flavor. We know that. The movie. Uh, they love strawberry. The movie Teen Wolf with Michael Jackson. No. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, Teen Wolf. Um, Shout out Michael J. Fox. Uh, I, they, I would recommend listening to the group Shiny because they have music for every single person. Shiny? Yeah. Shiny? S-H-I-N-E-E. Like there's at least one is that song boys for or you. girls? Boys. There's okay. five of them. They're incredible. And, okay, five and is what not genre true. is this? It's K-pop. But like they K-pop. do contemporary R&B <clears throat> to like electronic to anything. Okay. All right. I'm. I'll, I'll give it a shot. Shawl, rise up. <laughs> Need mythical merch in a hurry? Well, try Amazon.com/slash mythical for grooming, logo wear, and reissued designs delivered with prime shipping.